Hey guys, it's Kevin and you're watching my Carbon ROM review which is based on Android 4.3 which made it finally to the Motorola Droid Razer XT910 and XT912. So yeah, enjoy it. So yeah guys, let's start this review with the changes Google made in 4.3 to um, uh, 4.2 to uh, 4.3 uh, which are basically the um, APIs uh, which are um, low power Wi-Fi management and also low power location services which allow uh, for example maps to um, uh, to not um, enable uh, GPS so often so that's really cool so battery lasts longer I experienced that um, I have Wi-Fi on now and 15% battery and I use this phone for one hour now and it stays on 15% so that's great and yeah let's check out the settings um, you can uh, dark out the whole ROM like in AOKP and um, other great ROMs like Liquid Smooth. So just um, tap here to disable it. Um, so you get the Holo UI or enable it. And about phone, just for confirmation for you, Android version 4.3, which has the same logo and also the same animation. And you can flip the beans here and um, the build date is 8th of September and it's for the UMTS version, the GSM version of the Spider, the Razer XT910. And it has also great performance settings, but um, they won't allow you to overclock this phone. Um, but it's um, available on 4.2 ROMs, uh, for example, Liquid Smooth has released 4.2 and I also made a review for that you can check it out I'm not so sure if it was liquid smooth uh, where you can overclock but um, it was a 4.2 ROM uh, themes or themes work here just uh, download AOKP and um, CM10 themes CM10.1 and they will all work and you can also revert to the system current by hitting apply and yeah you can see it um, still 15% and check out the battery logo I think it's amazing and let's check out how you will, how you can change it just go to carbon fibers which is the interface settings menu and you can uh, just tap on interface and um, I recommend this one um, Recent Ramba mode, um, also available in 4.1 uh, ROMs, 4.2, and um, I guess 4.404 uh, uh, ice cream sandwich. Uh, the free Ramba, so 707 uh, megabytes used. Just tap here, and they all disappear. 590 Mbits megabytes used. Go back to Carbon Fibers interface, no, interface and recent swimmer, application and cache, cache and you can also enable only applications or none. And also the colors you can um, apply, uh, transparency settings, uh, okay, so yeah, this is basically, oh I set th this up. Um, this is the transparency setting for the status bar, which looks cool on these colorful home screens like mine. This wallpaper is also part of the ROM, but we get to that later in the review. I just want to show you the most important features you can play with this ROM. And what I love it, uh, what I love about this ROM is uh, this button. Just press it. Oh my God. Action overflow button, maybe visible until apps. Yeah. So uh, this menu, this um, yeah, this menu, uh, like in Google Maps or Google Mail, just tap here and you get the overview. Um, action overflow. Let 
let's adjust the camera a little bit sorry for that just um i think he has a little bit of noise in the picture but yeah who cares um lcd density uh clock widgets uh for those who wonder where um the settings for clock widget are the c log widget uh these are here so for weather panel for example you can um set this up for your for your needs update interval i have to check that and um, i like two hours here so it's this weather widget which you can customize in this menu here just hit apply and it's still on 15 percent check that out amazing Carbon fibers. Why have I noise in this picture? I can't explain that, but let's adjust that right here. So yeah, lock screen. Still a lot to talk about. Like allow all widgets, which is always great. And quick pin unlock. Music controls, of course. Oh, I keep hitting um, revert to the previous page navigation bar. I don't use this because I have hardware keys. Power menu, of course, when you want to have a screenshot. Yeah, nice. Ten, what the fuck? 10%? Oh. I always praise the battery life and then it skips 14%, 13 and 12 and 11 and it's on 10 percent great but yeah still good battery life sorry for that a screen uh, shot a link for the power menu and um, system bar uh yeah i guess uh, no people use this really this but you can enable it and of course the torch is very neat to have carbon fiber and i always hit revert reverse uh, back button uh, power widget power widget you can enable that so like in cm 10.1 or some other roms like aokp but 4.2.2 introduced introduced these tiles and i guess nobody uses these anymore so let's disable it but you can um, change the buttons and order and stuff and links for these buttons oh and always the back key when you want to use this uh, power widget but um yeah let's get to state spa ribbons is um is um, self-explaining you can check that out later when you also install this rom brightness slider auto close drawer is is uh, very nice yeah a uh, quick peek oh yeah so when you're in a full screen game or app i didn't check that uh, check this out sorry for that so when you're in a full screen game or app just slide down from the top and you can uh, peek at the status bar yeah when hidden by swiping down so yeah that's good and battery style i love these always i love it battery icon style and you get so many styles here like in no other rom i guess uh, aokp has uh, eight or nine but this has like enough for you a uh, square mod is there for you and um I will show you the most cool ones. Battery icon style. I will um, change the focus. Speedometer. Also great stuff. So yeah, just check it out and play with the ROM. You know it. So yeah, great, great um, features here. I recommend you to install this ROM. You can um, install it on uh, ROM slot 1, 2 or 3 in Safe Stripe Recovery. But I didn't check um, Boot Menu Manager, actually. But um, 
I would install it on uh, ROM slot 1. Uh, not the stock ROM slot, so it might be... Oh, I haven't had um, boot menu that that long, I didn't know. So just, just go for your second ROM slot, so just not the um, stock ROM. And check it out later. Signal status, of course, text or icon. When you always um, mess with these nice ROMs, you will know it, what you can do. And always the back button, of course. And status bar targets, change the order and um, also targets per row. I choose five, three is um, the, the stock setting on Android 4.0. 3 and 4.2. I like them to be a little bit smaller with two in a row. And uh, tile background style. Random colors. Also very cool. So just. Oh, yeah, 10%. I know that. And now you have random colors. And you can change them. Uh, yeah, okay. <laughs> so yeah, it's... Um, so changes are in the APIs and in the detail. And you get everything you will get on the 4.2 ROMs. I'm sorry for that bad lighting condition here. It's just not good. But um, yeah, uh, let's actually... Uh, get to the carbon wallpapers, which is the most important thing on ROM, in my opinion. I just scroll these uh, through quickly and you can check them out. I like them very much. And I will show you my favorites, which is... No... Oh yeah, this is great uh, with the um, uh, the table of the elements, uh, carbon ROM. And yeah, this I have right now. This is also very cool and this um, is my wallpaper right now. Let's go to this one and uh, set as wallpaper. So it um, sets the wallpaper through a server-based action it uh, quickly downloads the picture so it doesn't um, use your internal storage that's cool so yeah check it out the carbon rom and i love this wallpaper sorry for the lighting guys i hope you enjoyed this video please give me a thumbs up if you like what you saw i'm uh, kevin and yeah i'm having a full-time job now uh, that sucks in one way that I can't make that many videos for you <laughs> and yeah I have not that much time but yeah still uh, be subscribed and um, yeah be sure to check my Facebook page which is also in the description like all the other links and yeah have a great day as always see you bye